This video is sponsored by Zenmate. Hey everyone, Dan with Mac Rumors, and it's a new month, which means it's a new set of five macOS applications that we think you should check out for the month of September 2019. Before we get started, be sure to subscribe and hit the bell to get notifications whenever we share a video. The first app on our list is called Xnip, and it aims to improve and add additional features to the already robust set of features that macOS offers when it comes to taking screenshots. The two major features that Xnip boasts are its scrolling capture feature and the ability to screenshot multiple app windows. Unfortunately, the scrolling capture feature is watermarked unless you upgrade to the Pro version, but the watermark is rather small and really not a huge deal. Xnip also offers a built-in color tracker, rich annotation and editing features like a super quick and handy blur tool, as well as the app's other watermarked feature, Step Annotation. Now I wish the app was a one-time purchase instead of a subscription, but it's only $4.99 for the year, and so it could be worth it if you're taking advantage of the two watermarked features on a regular basis, but I absolutely love all of the intricate details and features that this app offers. Next up is In Your Face, and the app is extremely simple and very literal. Once you download In Your Face and select the corresponding calendars to sync with the app, every time you have a calendar event notification come through, it will now take up the entire screen as opposed to a small notification banner in the top right corner of your screen. Sometimes I tend to ignore those notifications or miss them completely, and with In Your Face being so well, in your face, it's kind of hard to be late to meetings, lunch, or whatever your calendar might be alerting you for ever again. With a one-time purchase of $1.99, the app does one thing and it does it very well. If you're a HypeMachine.com user or just a big fan of discovering new music, then you're gonna like this next app. This simple app is called Plug. Plug is a macOS application for the popular music discovery website, The Hype Machine, which curates tons of up and coming artists and songs from a lot of various publications and blogs on the internet. The app is divided into a few sections on the left side column, with the first tab being what's most popular at this current moment in time, but you can adjust this to include remixes only or no remixes, as the site kind of has a lot of remixes already, or what was popular last week. You can also see the music that you favorited, search by blogs, genres, what your friends are currently listening to, and more. If there's a song or artist that you like, not only can you hear it and save it for later in your favorites tab, but you can also click on the information icon to check out more about that artist on either Hype Machine's website or iTunes. I kind of wish this would open up in Apple Music and or Spotify, and I hope the app gets updated when Catalina is released and iTunes is no more. Either way, you can always find new music and add them to your streaming service of choice manually but I definitely recommend giving it a shot if you're looking for something new to listen to. It's totally free, so why not? Before we get into our next app, I wanted to talk to you more about today's sponsor, Zenmate. Zenmate is a popular VPN application, which stands for Virtual Private Network and allows users to browse the web with a greater sense of privacy and security. Aside from staying safe online, Zenmate can also help users unblock specific streaming content that might not be available in your country, encrypt data and browse the internet anonymously, protect your sensitive information such as banking details and passwords, especially when connected to a public Wi-Fi network, and much, much more. Zenmate has servers in over 35 countries, and once the app is installed and ready to go, connecting to a VPN is as easy as one click. Of course, there are plenty of options available in order to fine tune your experience, and you can choose from a list of specific countries for specific needs. Zenmate is available on macOS, iOS, Android, and Windows, and even streaming media players so that no matter what device you're connected to and using, you're always safe and protected. Click the link in the description down below to get Zenmate for as low as $21 for the entire year on up to five devices. Next up is ActiveDoc, and it's the fourth app on our list, and it's a total dock replacement with a lot of features that the regular macOS dock just doesn't offer. ActiveDoc allows grouping of documents and apps, quick switching between apps and windows, managing window sizes right from the Windows preview panel, and more. So one feature that's been on Windows PCs for a long time is the ability to hover over an app in your dock, and you'll see all of the corresponding windows associated. 
and you can easily select which window you want to open instead of opening them all up manually and then having to search through them. You can also group apps and folders in your dock and it can be very useful if there are apps and documents that you need in one location for quick access relatively frequently. And Active Dock even offers a start menu filled with tons of folders that you can easily access as well as system preferences and Active Dock preferences. Speaking of the Active Dock preferences, there are tons of custom settings and features that you can mess around with inside of the preferences menu, changing the appearance, customizing the icons, dock apps, and much more. The app offers a free trial, and if you love this total dock replacement, you can purchase a license for $20. Finally, our last application is called Gifski, and it has one job, and it also does it extremely well, and all for free. Gifski creates custom GIFs by simply dragging and dropping a video file into the app and then adjust the start and end points for your GIFs. You can then adjust the resolution and in a matter of moments, you have a very high quality GIF to use. Gifski supports a ton of different video formats and it's honestly quite a pleasure to use. Whether you use GIFs to enhance your online tutorials or maybe to just share ridiculous custom GIFs with your friends, the app is very simple, very good, and very free. Highly recommend. Be sure to let us know what you think of these Mac apps as well as your favorite apps that we should check out in the comment section down below. This has been Dan with Mac Rumors. Thanks for watching and I hope to see you around in the next video.